Good evening, Neo Digital VR. So today we are going to go through Moss. The description for the game and a link to the game is in the description box below. As always, please let me know how these videos are to you guys so I can keep making great content for you. Also, if you like the video and want to see more of these, please consider subscribing and hitting that little bell notification icon so you can get notified when I upload more content. Your time has come at last, dear reader. While we began this tale long ago, we hope it is yours to finish. But this story is not yours alone. No, it is tied to another. And the journey you take together could change the fate of both our worlds. Shall we begin? Yes, we shall. They called it the Cinder Knight. What came from those dark, starless skies would change the world of Moss forever. The peace that had settled across the land was broken by an unconquerable nightmare. And that night, the animals nearly met their end. First, they killed the king. A winged creature broke from the shadows and plucked him from his royal bedchamber high atop the tallest tower. Next, the serpent Sarfog and the armies of the Arcane tore up from the underworld. They ravaged the castle in search of that which gave the king power beyond understanding. One of the fabled glass relics. The King's Guard fought bravely, but the castle soon pulsed with the Arcane's evil. Every room was gutted, every statue, tapestry, and adornment hexed. But the glass was never found. Even the reclusive sprites set aside their differences on that faded night. They sent a great champion, empowered by their own glass relic, to challenge the serpent and its steel army. Meanwhile, Sir Argus, commander of the King's Guard, led the survivors west through a temple long abandoned by their ancestors and far away from their newly risen enemies. It was an arduous escape. Finally, after passage beneath the impassable mire, they found refuge in a clearing hidden safely in the trees. Argus charged back to join the Sprite Champion at the Mire's edge. Together, they fought back the Arcane and sealed the temple passage that led to the clearing. But the Champion was gravely injured. Clutching his glass, he retreated deep into the forest where he drew his last breath. A large tree grew upon him. It stood many years in watchful duty, safeguarding the glass and awaiting its next hero. Whoa. That hero, albeit an unlikely one, did arrive at a time she'd be needed most. Oh, that's the tree. Quill was out adventuring beyond the edge of the clearing. Dusk was creeping in, but she wondered what she might find if she went just a little farther.
She was not exactly sure what she roused, but she felt no danger from the being silently peering down at her. Oh my goodness! I'm no face! Quill had to hurry. The village gates would soon close and night would follow. Hey! <laughs> Look at me! You can see... That's so cool. I don't know if you guys can see this, but... You should be able to see this. Look, that's so dope. I have no face. So now we get to control Quill. So this is something that I've, I've been wanting to do for a while, is, is find a story-driven game in VR that I can showcase. I love story-driven content with so much. And this is a little bit, uh-oh. This is a little bit different than, not a little bit, but this is a lot different than the, um, the demo that we have at our store. You're hungry? You want to go this way? Like, I'm, by not controlling her, she tells me which way to go. That's so cool. And, and, and we're still no face. I love that. The amount of detail that they put into the rocks and into the environment is amazing. But let me let me go ahead and get the story moving for you guys. This is where we are. And I want to just soak in the environment just to make sure that I'm not missing anything. But you're going to go this way. I want you to go down that way. There you go. Let's see, how do we... Okay, we can turn it that way. So we're going to make her go up this way. Jump over here. Night, her uncle often warned, was when danger was most present. But Quill preferred the stories of the magical creatures that woke to protect the forest. Little platforming parkour action going on. Well, not parkour, but platforming action. I love platforming games. Okay, we're going to go this way. Now we're going to go ahead and move the stone back. There we go. So when I said at the store, I'm actually a brand ambassador. Oh, I've got a little scroll. You have earned a forgotten piece in, uh, in moss. Okay, cool. Okay, where's our buddy Quill? There she goes. It looks like they just closed the door on us. So, um, as I was saying, there's something over here. Let me check this out. Okay, uh, with the B button, I'm able to break this thing and, and gain, like, little orbs. And pressing the A button and B button at the same time allows us to do this dashing movement. Uh, a button is jump, B is attack, and you can do a little combo. So I'm do, so you can also do a jump, a jumping B, and that makes her slash down, which is really cool. I'm gonna be like Link, like Legend of Zelda, and just destroy everything I can destroy. But um, there we go. So, as I was saying, I'm a brand ambassador for um, a company, a third-party company. And what my program is, is the Oculus program. So, I don't work directly for Facebook. I don't work directly for Oculus. I just work for a third-party company that hosts Oculus products. And uh, we do that inside of uh, Best, Buy, uh, Best Buy stores. So, before... We had um, 
Oh, I missed it. We have um, demos for Oculus Rift. And one of the demos was Moss. And it started way different than this. Is there no way I can jump over there? Let's see. Try this one more time. Nope, I can't jump over there. I feel like I'm supposed to because there is a... Um, why is this thing jumping like that? Let me see if I can... There we go. There we go. Got it. I'm trying not to miss anything. So that's another forgotten scroll. And the moss demo that we played, that we had, was really fun. Okay, there's nothing here. I thought maybe we can go over here somewhere, but there's no doorway right here. It was really fun, but like this story, I, I knew that as soon as I would play that demo, it was going to be so rich. Hey, can I talk to you? No? Anything? Can I hit you? Ah, 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 ah. Pay attention to me. No? All right. So cute. Uh, he's looking at me. Oh, push him in. You've earned a... You earned the clearing in moss. What's that? Hey there. Oh, this person is fishing. Ooh, 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 ooh. He just opened the door. Ah, let me in. Let me in. Oh, little cute babies. This little mouse in a hat. Look at that guy. With his crooked little tail. Oh, man, I wish I could explore this place. Can I interact with that? Ah, oh. I was hoping like maybe I could pull the string, and make him thinking that think that he caught something. Hey, this is amazing. There's a scroll up there. I can see it. I want to get it. Also, my apologies if I'm uh, talking really loud. It's just the audio is pretty loud in my ear. Okay. Let me see here. Hi, what do you want me to do? Oh, I can stop it. Or at least slow it down. Oh, no, no, no. There you go. That is... This is so clean. I love it. And jump. There you go. Oh, this is amazing. And I love the hints, like it just told me how to do it. Let me see here. First, I'm gonna come over here and get this. Got another lost skull or lost piece. And jump up here. Nothing to break. All right. Type or walk over. Okay, so I'm, I need to slow this down again. About right there. There you go. Hit the action button or the, the fighting but Monster button. Quill had saved priceless grains from the hourglass.
She raced to the door of the cottage she shared with her uncle, hoping once he saw her discovery, he'd lose himself in tales of its legend. I love how things interact with her. Uncle Argus was watching the evening light dim when Quill burst through the front door of their cottage. Uncle! Uncle, there's something you have to see! Out past the bell again, he scolded. Quill, I've told you countless times. I know, Quill replied, crestfallen. I didn't mean to worry you, but I found something strange and magical. Quill's hands trembled as she showed him the glass. What is it? she asked. A look of panic spilled over her uncle's stoic exterior. Where did you find this? roared Uncle Argus. Quill had never seen her uncle so shaken. Just west of the clearing? she explained. And as soon as I picked it up, something started helping me. Uncle Argus followed her motion. A reader. With you, here, right now? Quill, what you found is very powerful and very dangerous, he said with great concern. If I could take this burden from you, I would. But this reader has chosen. Oh, whoa, so I'm called a reader? That's dope. It's like breaking the third wall, fourth wall. Even with the moon full and bright, I must go right away. Quill pressed. Where are you going? I can help. We can help. No, he snapped. They'll find you and tear you apart. I have to go alone. It is for your own safety and for everyone here in the clearing. His long, heartfelt hug told her he was heading for danger. I'll be back before midnight. Until I return, I need your word you will not leave the clearing with that glass. Promise me, Quill. I promise, she said reluctantly, wondering where her uncle was going so deep into the night. This narrator is amazing. <laughs> This is where the demo starts. Look at that, like lighting effect. Hey kid, kid, wake up. Hey kid, over here. I know where your uncle went. I can show you. You're twofold now. Very important. Bring that glass and your sidekick too. We're going to need them. Okay, let me see if I can Quill open. Hey, Starthing, wait! There we go. I would have missed that. They didn't have that in the demo. had never met a starving. In campfire stories, they often meddled in the lives of mortals. And when they appeared, mischief followed. Like, I don't know what I'm actually getting, but destroying these things reminds me- through the eastern gate was strictly forbidden. But despite her promise, 
Quill knew in her heart that Uncle Argus needed her. Destroying these boxes reminds me of the orbs that you get from, um... <coughs> Another scroll over here. <clears throat> you guys may, may be too young to remember a game called Omni Musha. You get demon orbs to, like, upgrade your sword. Or in God of War, you uh, get, like, red orbs or blue orbs to upgrade Who your magic. Demanded answers. Starving, you can't just barge in here with your riddles. Where is he? What do you know? The trouble your uncle's heading for is the kind only you and that silent giant up there can get him out of. Hmm. I need to pull this out. Oh no, I need to push it in. See if I can do this without... There we go. It's a little difficult because I'm actually uh, really close to the, um, to the sensors. So they're, they're losing track. Okay, let me pull this. Bring this back. This way, kid, urged the starving. And don't forget to tuck your ears in. see deer in the background just look at my face again so cool you've earned the impassable mire in moss nice I guess those are like achievements giant rusty axe Also, please let me know if the, um... Oh, whoa. Hey, buddy. Please let me know if uh, the camera angle and the camera movement is, is too jumpy for you guys. I'm trying my best to keep it as slow and as smooth as possible. But it is something that I'm trying to work on to improve on. There is a scroll right there. We're going to try to get it. I got to see how to get over there though. I wonder is there another... Oh, no. I should be able to walk in there. Yep, here we go. I love how the deer can even see her. One right here.
and our trusty steed. Well, at least my grandfather's steed. Was it grandfather or father? I'm so enthralled by the video, I wasn't even paying attention to what, uh, what relation that guy was. Ugh, there we go. Okay, back up here. Well, let me see if you guys can see this. Just on the other side is the Maya. <clears throat> the Starthing assured her. There's a good chance your uncle's still there. Okay. I actually want to get up there to where... To where he is, though. I don't think... I guess I can't. Look at this battlefield. Did you hear that? The Starling seemed anxious. I've ruffled enough leaves in these parts. I can't be seen with you. I'll catch up with you later. Just don't go and die on me. All right. No. You earned thank you in Moss. <laughs> That's tight. If you guys have been thinking about picking up Moss, I definitely recommend it. It is absolutely amazing. There we go. Yeah, let's take out all that. So the good thing about it, I can look around, look at different paths, try to get a different angle on stuff. So I think the game is uh, actually $19.99 right now. So um, check it out. You can also put it on your wish list and just kind of wait for it to, um, oh no, I wasn't supposed to jump. No, nope, I wasn't supposed to jump. You can uh, check it out on your wish list. I mean, put it on your wish list and check it out. And every now and then it may go on sale for maybe, you know, 10, 20% off. But this is a game where it's, I, I would recommend buying it at, no matter what the price was. Because this is, oh no. This is one of those, I would consider this a AAA title. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, now, in the demo. Hold on, all right, quick. Let me get back there. Look at that. You can see her health bar. So when her health is low, it goes to red instead of um, instead of going blue. Uh-oh. All right. So I'm kind of thinking that 
there's no reason to go over there. Let me try that one more time. Actually, no. I don't think there's any reason to go over there. But if that was the case, why can I jump up here? Nope. Yeah, so there's nothing over there on the other side. So if you found a way to get to the other side, let me know. But as of right now, I'm kind of considering that like a red herring. That pathway uh, being there just is probably a, a part of the background. Because I don't see a platform or feel a platform that I can jump to. Oh, hey, hey. Got another one. Nice. Okay, let's just jump down here. I feel like this is going to be a fight. Got him. <laughs> Bring it, son. You've earned their first trial in Moss. Oh no! <laughs> and then the thorn kills me. Come here, buddy. I got gotcha. you. 